Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Hannah, and tonight, because it is like 9:49 p.m., I just wanna just obey the spirit, word spirit, and just let him flow. Tonight, it's just I'm like I said, I'm just gonna let God flow. I'm gonna worship God. I'm gonna pray. Whatever the spirit leads me to do tonight, this is what I'm gonna do. And this song is just in my spirit, and I'm gonna sing it, even though my voice is not the best. But <laughs> hallelujah! For you are great, you are a miracle so great, and there is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. For you are great, for you the miracle so great, and there is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. For you are great, you the miracle so great, and there is no one else like you there is no one else like you for you are great for you the miracle so great and there is no one else like you there is no one else like you Hallelujah, mighty God. There is no one else like you, O oh God, for you are great. You do miracles so great, O oh God. And there is no one else like you. None can compare to your mattress works. None can compare to you, O oh God, for you are the way maker. You are the promise keeper. You are the light in the darkness. Mighty God, I just want to bless your holy name, O oh God. I worship you, God, for who you are. I bless your holy name. For who you are, God, I worship your holy name. You are God all by yourself, oh God. You are God all by yourself. You are unchangeable. You are unstoppable. You are unshakable. Mighty God, I bless you. I bless you. I bless you. I worship you, oh God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Mighty God, I lift up all your children into your hands, oh God. Mighty God, I pray for a revival in every soul. I pray for a revival in each and every individual right now. Oh God, everywhere you know their whereabouts, oh God. Though it may look like so much oh god in my eyes but lord you know each and every individual oh god you know every strand of hair on their head god you know every thought that they think and god i pray oh god for total revival oh god i pray father god lord you will revive every soul oh god i pray that every dry bones will live again mighty god i ask that lord you father god will let there be an overflow of your presence let there be an overflow of your power oh god let there be an overflow of you oh god mighty god give your trend more of you oh god give them more, more oil oh god in their lamps oh god that they'll keep burning oh god they'll keep burning for you oh god mighty god i pray oh god lord your fire will burn in every heart to oh god let praises rise from the inside oh god fill your children's life oh god fill their hearts fill our hearts oh god with more of you oh god till all they see that it is you oh god mighty god you know just what to do oh god you perform miracles oh god my god and i just want to worship you oh god hallelujah 
mighty god you have so much in store for your children and i pray god for total victory oh god i pray for total breakthroughs i pray for total deliverance oh god in the mighty name of jesus my god i know god as you are able to do exceedingly above all what we may ask or think oh god jesus i need you oh god we need you we need you we need you oh god lord we cannot do anything without you oh god we cannot do nothing without you god and lord we need you oh god we need an an pouring of your anointing of god and a pouring of you oh god of more of you mighty god in the mighty name of jesus lord hallelujah i just want to worship you oh god i just want to exalt your holy name oh god those who are discouraged oh god i pray god what you encourage them oh god those who are broken, oh God. I pray, Father God, that you mend every heart, oh God. Mend every brokenness, oh God. Mend it, oh God. For you are, oh God, Lord, you can mend every heart, oh God. You can mend every soul, oh God, in the name of Jesus. My God, I pray, oh God, for those, those who are, oh God, struggling, oh God, with so much, oh God, so many circumstances, oh God, so many situations, oh God, they are struggling with so many things, oh God, and they do not know where to turn or who to turn to. God, I ask that Lord, you, Father, God, will help them that they will turn to you, oh God. Mighty God, give them a revelation. Mighty God, give them a song, a scripture, a word, oh God. Bring, oh God. Bring something to them, whether they, oh God, will know that you love them, oh God. They will know that you care for them, oh God. My God, I pray, oh God, Lord, you, Father God, will intervene. You will intervene in every heart. You will intervene in every soul, oh God. In the mighty name of Jesus, oh Lord, I pray for total victory, oh God. In the name of Jesus, I pray for total victory for your children. I pray for total victory upon your children, oh God. In the name of Jesus, my God, intervene, intervene, intervene. Oh God, open doors upon your children behalf of oh God. Doors that the enemy are shut. Open greater ones, oh God. Open bigger ones, oh God, in the name of trust. And I pray, oh God, Lord, you will shut all doors that the enemy has opened up on your children's life, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Confuse the enemy right now, oh God. God, I ask that Lord, you will confuse the enemy. All, oh God, the devil, oh God, all those that the devil is literally. After God, I pray, Father God, Lord, you, Father God, will intervene. My God, I pray, God, for turn around, oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus. My God, hallelujah, have your way, have your way, have your way, oh God. My God, I pray, Father God, Lord, you deliver and set free, oh God. Those who are bound, oh God, I ask that Lord, you, Father God, will lose them, lose them from the plans of the enemy, oh God. Lose them, oh God, from, oh God, evil, oh God. Lose them, mighty God, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. My God, I ask that Lord, you will intervene, O oh God. Mighty man of war, lion of Judah, come on, what only you can do. Mighty God, come and do what only you can do, O oh God. Consecrate your children, O oh God. Sanctify your children, O oh God. Lord, mold your children. Fashion them in your image, O oh God. Purge them, O oh God, with hyssop, that they shall be clean. Wash them, that they shall be whiter than snow, O oh God. Jesus, let your living water flow over your children, O oh God. Let your living water flow within your children, O oh God. Hallelujah. Mighty God, we need you. 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 Is there time that we ever need you, O oh God? It is now. It is now more than ever, O oh God. Hallelujah. Lord, you know just what to do. God, we look to you, God. You are where our help comes from. Give us vision to see things like you do. Mighty God, we look to you tonight, O oh God. Give us wisdom, O oh God, for you know just what to do, O oh God. Mighty God, increase our love for you. Increase our zeal for you, O oh God. Hallelujah. Increase, O oh God, our desire to serve you, O oh God. Anoint your children afresh, O oh God. In the name of Jesus, I pray for total protection. I pray for divine protection upon your children, O oh God. O oh God, from evil, from sicknesses, from viruses, O oh God, and from the plans of the enemy, O oh God. In the name of Jesus, and I pray for the God, Lord, you come and do what only you can do tonight. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Whatever it is that you want God to do for you. Speak to him. Speak to him. Speak to him. Tell him what you want. Tell him what you need. 
he is listening as wide open let god know what you want let him know what you want you want victory ask it to god tell him what you want victory over you are struggling with something tell god that you want to stop it tell him why you want to stop it you have to acknowledge what you want to god yes he know all things but acknowledge it to god tell it to him let it be known to him and see how he works see how he intervenes see how he makes a way god has so much god has so much in store for his children he has so much in store for you but he wants you to receive it he wants you to accept him first he wants you he wants you he has called you you haven't called yourself you haven't chosen yourself god is the one who have chosen you but you have to accept that call you have to choose you have to choose that life too yes god has already written your life he has already set it and laid out already for you but you have to choose that life too because it's never forced it is never forced yes god has called you and everything but you have to make that decision for yourself hallelujah for those of you who are struggling with whatever it is tell god to intervene speak to him you are struggling with something and you want to stop tell god remove it from your imagination remove it from your mind remove it from your heart remove that desire that maybe you have for that thing remove it from you remove that taste that you have for it tell god to to renew you to renew your mind to renew your soul to renew your heart to renew to renew your body to renew your life to renew you speak to him let it be known to him you want to change something in your life let it be known to him tell him you want to change it tell him why you want to change it acknowledge it to him let it be known to him by you letting it be known to him he then sees that you are really ready and not just ma- make known to him and then maybe you focus on something also like you're not that ready no you have to be really ready you have to believe in what you ask for and everything God is so awesome. God is so awesome. This is why you have to taste Him for yourself. Not just taste. But this is why you need Him for yourself. There is so much. So much in store. For you and I. There is so much in store for us. but we have to want it too and we don't just have to want it only but we need to want god too and not just want him but we have to serve him we need to give him our all we have to accept him accept his love accept his promises accept his blessings worship god worship and prayer are so powerful these two things are just powerful weapons worship when you do not know what else to do worship god you do not have to do it like how others do it no do it how you can do it 
pray to him not how others can but pray the way you can ask him to help you because he can teach you how to pray he can teach us how to pray there is nothing that we that there is nothing that god cannot help us to especially when it comes to to his kingdom to his ki- to things that is in his kingdom to things that is of his kingdom which is why he always says that he will never leave us nor forsake us whatever that you need god is the one that you can call on to he knows how to help you he has his word his word his word is something that can really help you in everything in every situation everything god's word can help you we are never alone even in the darkest hour even in the midnight hour we are never alone call on to god he is just a prayer away he is just a call away not know what to say if you just cry alone you can cry cry it cry on to god he understands tears more than any language he understands it so much he understands it and even though you might not know why you're crying god knows why you're crying and he understands it again i can feel that there is so much so much in store for god's children there is so much in store for you but just worship god just when you don't know what else to do just just worship 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 him worship him in the midnight hour when you do not know what to do when thoughts come into your mind replace it with worship replace replace it with a prayer and pray unto god you are struggling with something pray to god Talk to him. Converse with him. There is so much, so much, so much. And there is nothing that God. There is nothing that God cannot do for us. He wants to do so much for us. So much. So much. hallelujah mighty god those who are in need of your wisdom your knowledge your understanding your annual discernment i ask you god to give it to them god i pray that lord you father god will fill your children up with the fruits of your spirit fill us up oh god with more of you fill us up with your holy spirit Fill us up, O oh God. Reveal those, O oh God, who wants to know their purpose. Reveal it to them, O oh God. Reveal it to them, mighty God. Those who are just... Lord, they just not know what else to do, God. They are just stuck, O oh God. Mighty God, make a way, O oh God. Lord, you can meet them right where that they are. You can touch them right where that they are. You know exactly how to work in their life. You know exactly what they need, oh God, at this very moment. And I ask you, God, to intervene. Those who need to make decisions, give them clarity. Give them your wisdom, your knowledge, your understanding, and your discernment, oh God. Mighty God, help them that they will seek you. Before they even make any decision, they will seek you, God. They will seek you to know what you want them to do, O God, in the name of Jesus. Mighty God, have your way, have your way, have your way, have your way, O God. Jesus. Hallelujah. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Mighty God, heal those who are sick. Those on the hospital beds, heal them, oh God. Whatever the problem is, heal them. You are the mighty healer. You are the mighty deliverer. You are the greatest physician. You are the greatest doctor. Heal them, oh God. Heal them, Papa. 
in the name of Jesus, those on their beds, oh God, those in their homes, those on the streets who are sick, oh God. Heal them, oh God. Those who are sick mentally, heal them. Those who are sick emotionally, heal them, oh God. Heal the hearts of your children, oh God. Those whose hearts are just broken. It is in pieces. Heal their hearts, oh God. Heal them, oh God. Those who are on the verge of committing suicide, please intervene, God. Show up in their situation. Help them to know and to feel that you love them, that you care for them, that you are the way maker, that you can deliver them. Mighty God, intervene, O oh God, intervene. Those in authority, O oh God, give them the wisdom, the knowledge, and the understanding. Help them, O oh God, turn their hearts to you, O oh God, and help them that they will seek you before they make any decision, O oh God. My God, intervene, intervene, O oh God. Come on, what only you can do, mighty man of war. Jesus, you are Yahweh, Alpha and Omega. And I ask that Lord, you, come on, what only you can do. You make the lint to walk, you make the blind I see. Jesus, and you give us victory. You are victorious, oh God. My God, hallelujah. I just want to say thank you. Thank you, Lord, for you understand everything. My God, thank you for your grace and your mercies. Thank you for your many blessings. Thank you that you use situations that are just, it just seems hopeless. Just to use your children. Just to intervene, oh God, hallelujah. Just for you to win a soul, for us to win a soul, God. Jesus, hallelujah. We just want to say thank you. I just want to say thank you, oh God. I just want to say thank you, Papa. Hallelujah. Jesus. I thank you, God. Thank you for healing those who are, oh God, those who are faced with cancer, those who are faced with diabetes, those who are faced with high blood pressure. God, you ah the mighty healer and i thank you for healing and delivering and setting through oh god hallelujah thank you lord for having your way thank you lord for answering not only my prayers but all the rest of those who are praying oh god thank you mighty god thank you holy spirit hallelujah i'm not sure what exactly to name this <laughs> video but you know what? I'm just I was just letting God have his way. Though it might seem all over the place. But God is good. All the time and all the, all the time God is good. He is the way maker. He is the promise keeper. He is the light in the darkness. Focus on him. And if there is any disturbance, if there is any distraction that is preventing you from focusing on him, tell him to remove it. Tell him to remove if his all imaginations, if his all mindsets, if his all thoughts, if his all sins, if his all wrongdoings, if his all doings, whatever it is ask him to remove it and ask him to replace it with his godly character with his godly behavior with his godly attitude hallelujah 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 lord i thank you i praise you and magnify you oh god hallelujah Hallelujah. A relationship with God is just so amazing. Knowing God for yourself is so amazing. Life. Though it isn't always easy to understand, God never 
allows anything to happen without a reason, without a purpose. He lets everything happen just to lead us to our purpose. Just to lead us to that assignment that he has for us. But you really need his discernment to know where he is leading us. Where he is leading us to. What he wants us to do. We really are nothing without God. We really cannot do nothing without him. But anyways guys, I will stop here. And I will end by saying... The answer that you are looking for is found in God. Build a relationship with Him. Speak to Him. Pray to Him. Whatever it is that you feel, tell it to Him. He knows and He understands everything. You don't have to look for big words to tell it to Him. Just say it. Just speak it, speak it out to him, speak it the way that you can. Ensure that you are honest with God with exactly what you are going through. Because whether you are honest about what you're going through or not, God still knows already. Even before you even say it, he knows, but he just wants you to say it to him, acknowledge it. The importance of acknowledging it, huh? Acknowledge it to Him. Let it be known to Him. Yes, He knows already, but let it be known to Him. Seek and you shall find. Knock on the door shall be opened unto you. Hallelujah. But anyways, guys, have a good night. If it's night for you, have a great day. If it's day for you, and just give all the glory and honor to God. Praise Him in every situation. Pray out. Pray to Him in every situation. And just let Him be God in your life. Love you always. And your glory is out.